So a warm welcome to you to our day two of our 10 days of statistics and today we are going to be talking about basic probability. We have a challenge here to solve and it, it says that in this challenge we will practice calculating probability and there's a tutorial tab but you don't have to worry about this, I'm going to explain everything to you right here in my whiteboard here. It says in a single, in a single toss of two fair uh, evenly weighted six-sided dice, find the probability that their sum will be at most ninth. Okay, let's go solve it. So we, we, are, we are expected to find the probability that the sum will be at most nine. So it's going to be nine less than or equal to nine, all right? Okay, so one way to approach this is to, is to go ahead to calculate this probability. Remember that the probability is expected expected over all, all right? So expected results over all items or the sum of all items in the sample space. So what we are saying is that the sum of everything will be 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, all the way to 6, 6. So these are sample space and the sum of this will be 36. So if our sample space is S, the sum of the sample space will be 36, okay? Now, we can calculate all these combinations that give us items less than or equal to 9, but we can use this formula that says P of A, P of A plus P of A complement is equal to 1. Right, so we can actually use this formula in this case. P of let's say P complement will now be sum where the values are greater than nine, and in this case, our A, our A will now be the set of values that give us summation of nine. So it's going to give us it's going to be six three uh, greater than nine. So we don't have equal to 9, so it's going to be 6, uh, 6, the first one will be 6, 4, um, greater than 9, right? It's going to be 6, 5, and we're going to be, it's going to be 6, 6, and since we are talking about 2 dice, it's going to be times 2, and therefore our A here will be what? It's going to be 12, right? So this is what our A is going to be. Alright, so, so our A now which is actually A complement, because in this case we are saying we are calculating the A complement. Okay, so if we are now calculating the probability of the A complement, it's going to give us uh, the value, uh, it's going to be 12 over 36, and 12 over 36 is going to give us what? It's going to give us 1 over 3. Oh, sorry, there's a, there's a mistake. So this is actually going to be 6 and not 12. So this is going to be 6. So here is going to be, uh, is going to be 6 over 36. So it's going to give us 1 over 6. And therefore, if we apply this formula, we, we can now calculate the probability for A, which will now be 1 minus 1 over 6. And that's going to give us 5 over 6. So that means we've used this complement formula to get the result we want. So if we go back to HackerRank, we can simply reveal this answer and you can see that the correct answer is 5 over 6. So I'm going to be stopping here. We are going to, we are going to be moving on to the next part and that will be more dice. I would like to thank you for viewing. Please remember to subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment if you have any questions or any uh, recommendations you would like to make, I remain kind on the Tech Pro and I'm always there for you.